In this video, you will learn how to use the eCPR feature. By the end of this video, you should be ready to calibrate the CPR sensors, start a CPR session on Victoria, monitor the quality of CPR with the automatic detection and logging features, and create an eCPR report for debriefing. Click the CPR tab in the submenu on the bottom. Before performing CPR for the first time, the simulator needs to be calibrated. To calibrate, click the menu icon in the upper right of the software. Scroll over Setup and click Calibration. Repeat the following steps for compressions and ventilations. Click Chest Compressions. Then click Next. Click Normal Calibration. Then click Next again. Click Start and perform one compression. Wait for the software to prompt you for the second, third, fourth, and fifth compressions. After completing five compressions, click Save. Then click Finish. Repeat the steps with the ventilation calibration. Once the simulator has chest compressions and ventilations calibrated, click the EKG vital and set the simulator to the appropriate vitals for a session of CPR. Once the simulator is ready, click the Start button in the CPR page. The software will detect and log the compression rate and depth and the ventilation volume and duration. After the CPR session, you can view the performance log. Click the Reports button at the top and click the report of the session that you want to view. The eCPR training report lists the objectives of the session and displays the results of the performers against those objectives. There are also visual charts of each CPR cycle in the report for the breakdown of each cycle individually. These reports can be printed, saved, or shared electronically for easy debriefing. 